dressing like broke man bait. What is broke man bait? This part. My friends say I only like rich guys. No, it's not that I like rich guys. Rich guys like me, and I'm gonna tell you why. I follow something called the law of two thirds. Every time I leave the house, two out of three of these things have to be on point. One, my hair. Two, my makeup. And three, my outfit. Notice she didn't say nothing about how she is as a person, her attitude and all of that. You can see right from the video right now that she really has a stank attitude, but let's continue. Say you're going to Target. Remember, rich men shop at Target. It's not just anyone at Target. Everyone goes to Target. How Ladies, don't believe that. There's not a lot of rich people in general just driving down the street or just walking down the street. So don't think you're finna go in Target and think you're gonna see somebody rich, some rich guy walking down the aisle just waiting to see you. Women re really need to stop uh, lying to other women telling them these type of things because that is definitely not true. If you wanna know how many rich people there actually are in this world, just in this country, because I'm in the US, look at some stats. How you look and how you are carrying yourself out in public is going to attract the type of men that you want to attract. If you are in Target in baggy sweatpants, yes, you're going to get the, hey, can I holler at you a minute? I can't even say it because those men don't have the audacity to speak to me. The audacity to speak to you? I don't think you're going to have a problem with too many men wanting to speak to you with that stanky attitude that you got. I mean, she really thinks she is all that. And she's not. She is basic and plain. But she thinks she's all that. And unfortunately, a lot of women will listen to this and then go outside and go to Target and act the same way. It's just ridiculous. That sounds really rude. But again, how you carry yourself and how you present yourself in public is going to attract what you want to attract. So if you're out there looking like a rich bitch, you're going to get a rich man. It's easy as that. Actually, rich men don't care about women being rich. That's the last thing he's thinking about. He knows what comes along with rich women, high maintenance women. They want to be the boss. They're highly masculine. Maybe she's super successful. What did it take for her to get successful? She had to be very, very masculine. And you can tell that she's very, very masculine. You see, it doesn't matter how attractive you are. If you're masculine, that's an immediate turn off for men. Definitely a man that has means, that has money. He doesn't want to deal with that. Why go to work, bust your ass, do all you need to do as a man, you know, build the world and then come home and have to deal with that. And then she's talking about Target. Why aren't you on? Why not? Why, why not in the expensive stores? Since that is the type of person that you think you are. But you're in Target thinking you're going to find a rich man walking down the aisle in the in, in the electronic section. It's just ridiculous. The main thing that men care about is your attitude, who you are as a person. We don't really care about all the clothes you got on, you know, if you're wearing Cartier or you're wearing Gucci and, you know, the red bottom shoes and all of that. Men don't care about that. Men will pick the woman that has on sweats, jeans, a T-shirt, hair pulled back, hardly no makeup or anything over this all day long because men don't care about that. What men say is, OK, she's every day. She's basic. She's normal. And she's beautiful for who she is. And she looks good on the outside. And then when she dresses up and she puts all that glamour stuff on, it just makes it even better. But men don't walk outside, definitely walk through Target and say, oh, let's see who's the, the, the most well-dressed female in here. She's the one I want. This is all just delusion. And unfortunately, these women influence other women because women are highly influenced by other women and they want what other women have. If they see a woman in a nice car, I want that. If they see a woman in a nice dress, nice outfit, I want that. If they see a woman with a nice looking guy, I want that guy. Let me try to steal him from this woman. So it's all a lot of competition. And unfortunately, like I keep saying, these women give other women advice and these women just go out there and just do it. And it doesn't work. I'd like to see a follow up, see what her life is right now. But you notice, like I said in the beginning, she never, ever talked about who she is as a person, who you are, how you talk, your attitude. It's all about the clothes. It's all about being looking rich. If you think that that's going to attract a man, you're going to be waiting for a long time.